Born the illegitimate daughter of a slave, Francisca de Paula de Jesus, known as Nia Chica, was the first Afro-Brazilian woman to be beatified. The following is a short biography of her life. She was born in 1808, or 1810 according to some sources, in Minas Gerais, Brazil. Her mother was a slave and her father is unknown. Her mother also had a son from a different father. Growing up, her mother ensured that she learned her prayers and devotions. She desired to hear the scriptures read throughout her life, even though she could not read them herself. She is quoted as having said, I wanted only to listen to the reading of sacred scripture. When someone granted me that pleasure, I was satisfied. Her mother was given her freedom when Francisca was 10, but she died soon after. Before she died, she asked Francisca to dedicate her life to her faith and to helping the poor. Newly orphaned, she chose to live alone rather than with her brother. She lived in a small cottage outside of town where she eventually started to care for the poor. As she got older, she received offers of marriage, but she always refused them. She hosted regular prayer meetings and provided weekly lunches for the poor in her neighborhood. People eventually started coming from far and wide to ask for her prayers and to hear her advice. Although she was a former slave and a descendant of slaves, she attracted people of every race and political leaning because they saw in her a woman of God, full of faith and love. When her brother died, he left her an inheritance. She kept living her simple life and used the money to help the poor. In 1888, she drew up a will that left all of her resources to her local parish. It also asked for a number of masses to be said for her soul. She died on June 14, 1895, at the age of 85. She was beatified in 2013 and became the first Afro-Brazilian woman to become a blessed. Her feast day is on June 14th. She is a patron of the Brazilian poor. Thank you.